back when the coal industry was getting spun up in the world in North Dakota, um, it was successful for three reasons. Um, or there, there's kind of three legs of that partnership. The federal element, um, there was a lot of support for the coal industry in the 70s, and it's because um, energy was um, uncertain. You had the oil embargo, you had a lot of these things. They didn't know how much natural gas we were gonna be able to discover. Um, but we knew we had a lot of coal. So the federal government implemented policies to incentivize the use of coal. We had such great um, resources here in North Dakota that the federal government invested in the coal industry here. So that's one of the things we need to replicate is we need to get that federal element um, involved. The second thing we need is to get um, the state involved. Um, again, we don't, it, without policies that encourage the construction of new um, large infrastructure projects in energy, um, we're not gonna go anywhere and they're gonna get built somewhere else, whether it's in Texas or whether it's overseas. Um, the coal world is gonna continue to progress. Um, we think that if you have the right partnership, it's gonna progress in North Dakota and then expand outward. And the third thing we need is we need the public of North Dakota, both the general public and the business owners in North Dakota to um, continue to support policies that are gonna benefit everybody economically. So that's kind of where we think there's a role for the chambers in this is to say, um, can, can they support a mechanism by which North Dakota increases its investment, not just in coal, but in all new sources of energy the mechanism that we think is best is to create some kind of fund within the state of North Dakota that would um, partner with the federal government and private industry to build not commercial, but demonstration um, technology for new energy um, projects. Um, and it's kind of that role of, let's prove that the technology works before we turn it exclusively over to the private industry.